Well, that moment when you find out, found out that you won that amazing competition, what was going through your mind? Because it hasn't even been 48 hours yet. No, um, I cried really hard. <laughs> <laughs> it's been over two years since we introduced you to the first Torontonian to ever win the Boots and Heart Showcase. After a long journey, David Boyd James has finally released his debut album. How does it feel to have the number one country album in Canada? You know, we thought it was a mistake. We're like, we need a recount. <laughs> Before David won the Boots and Hearts Showcase in 2019, he went through a rough breakup in 2017 that changed his life as he knew it. And he used that pain to fuel his passion and now has a number one album. It's just, it, I, I'm just, I just can't believe it. I'm, I'm, I, I wanted, my goal was to um, try and put Toronto on the map in a big way in country music because I'm literally from here. You know, I was born two minutes down the road. I was born at St. Joe's Hospital. Like, um, it's just, and I, I'm just really grateful that I get this opportunity to, to do that. And Toronto's right behind you for the riders round and all this. When you look at the venues, like you can see like Budweiser stage right past there, Scotiabank Arena. Is there a venue there that you would love to play your working towards playing at? All of them. <laughs> <laughs> since, since I was 12, um, we would drive by, um, I, Molson Amphitheater, I know it's the Budweiser stage, but we'd drive by there and I'd just say one day, one day mom, you know, I'd look out the window and I'd just stare at it and um, to think that we're getting closer and closer to that being becoming a reality. Always one to put others first, he has created the writer's room that will help showcase other artists and will help grow their businesses in a professional setting. You know, so that's that's the whole, the whole writer's round thing was to, um, <laughs> I put right on the poster, I was like, you know, support a show that pays the artists, you know, which is a bold statement, but I, I feel like too many people are afraid of saying, well, can you pay me something? Because then they won't get the opportunity. To sign up for the writer's room and buy tickets, you can go to David's website at davidboyjames.com. For City News, I'm Lindsay Dunn.